Okay, YouTube, this is a quick video on KDE Plasma Mobile. I've been playing with it for a few hours now. Um, it's uh, got some nice uh, additions. Um, there's some things that are still kind of uh, quirks about it. It does lag, it does um, still crash uh, a bit, but I mean, there is some, some new features. Um, I am connected to Wi-Fi. And you'll see uh, some of these apps are a little slow to load. Um, active connections. Let me go to uh, go to the internet. Scaling is a little bit weird. Um, it's probably just with the app. I don't know why it's doing that. So I was saying that sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. There it goes. Got the Discover Store. I was able to do some updates from here. Um, some some basic file system updates. Up it crashed. So as you can see, some of the apps um, take a while and then they'll crash. Uh, I did have this up and running earlier. I was able to pull those updates. Okay, move on. Now I did try flashing this right to the um, the EMMC. However, once I did that, uh, the screen nothing would turn on. It, it just appeared um, that it just didn't want to work. Uh, but so right now this is all going off a, a flash drive or the SD card. Um, so I think that's probably why there's some uh, some lagging. It seems like the caps is on by default. So I always have to take that off uh, after I begin typing. Okay. I mean, so as you can see, there's still some work that's got to be done to it. Um, as far as appearance-wise, I think it's it's come a long way. Uh, it looks a lot better. It's more um, uh, looks like they modernized it. I know when it first came out, uh, it just it had a really really old uh, appearance, but um, they got some material-looking things uh, going with it now. Um, but the problem is, it, it still kind of it lags and um, it, it crashes from the time to time. I think probably the first couple of hours I was using it. Um, the screen would just uh, be frozen, uh, kind of whitewashed out, and then it would respond again, but then it would crash. Um, but as you can see, I mean, it definitely has a new new appearance to it. Uh, the bottom 
dock is now clear. It used to have that white bar that went across. And uh, they used to have a house for the KDE uh, logo. Um, some of the things that don't work still, uh, the flashlight doesn't work, sound doesn't work, the brightness does work, as you can see. Uh, the battery indicator, mm -hmm. I want to say it's, I think it's at, uh, accurate. You can see up in the corner, it says 43%. Um, let's see if it still has the dummy outputs. Can't choose those. Okay. All right. Well, I guess that's it for now. Uh, I apologize for the uh, kind of just waiting uh, just to have these apps load. Um, but that's that's uh, KDE Plasma. Uh, I mean, it has come a long way. Uh, it is a little bit more stable. However, there's still some work that's got to be done. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching.